What's, What's up, Chimmy Squad? Squad? Welcome back to our channel! Ooh. If you guys are new here, I'm Shay. I'm Eunice. And today we have Trinidad Daddy and Food! Our first time, once again, requested by our lovely subscribers. As you can tell, it's our first time with this culture as well. So we had to call up the restaurant and ask them what their most authentic, most popular Trinidadian dishes were. So we came up with these. So we got some doubles over here. It's a common street food. It's made with two barras and filled with curry, chana, and various chutneys. Mmm. And we got some rice with oxtail. Look at all that sauce. Oh my goodness. We got some chicken roti over here. We're gonna cut it right now and show you guys. They said it's kind of like a burrito. Ooh. <gasps> Yum. So you guys already know what time it is. Time to give a shout out to the first five commenters that commented hashtag Chimmy Squad on our last mukbang. So thank you so much to Anjali Lohana, Khan Farah, Mehak Salim, Asma Fatima, and Stacy Valanka Mendez. Yay! Thank you guys so much. Make sure to comment now for a shout out on our next mukbang. Comment now. We also got some pear drinks. Pear drinks? I this guess. looks legit. I guess it's sparkling pear drink. And it's actually from Trinidad, so I'm super excited. Oh my gosh, authentic once again. Ladies and gentlemen, we did it. So we were looking at the refrigerator and we were so curious about this one drink. They were like, you can just have it if you want. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we're like, really? Thank yeah. you. <laughs> it's called Chubby. Mm. Like banana soda, right? Yeah. This guy is so cute. This little character in the front. Ugh, we're obsessed with these. Say grace. Yes. Okay. Amen. Amen. Oh, I love how this is packaged. This kind of reminds me of Pakasu. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Cheers. Mmm. That's good. <sighs> Sorry. That tastes amazing. I like the flavor. It's very light. Mmm. It's very light, but it has enough of that little carbonation yeah. to help your food digest. Do mm. you want to try some of the chubby? Yeah, I want to try. It looks orange. Ooh, that hangi of banana. Yeah? Yeah, The soda's stick. orange, but the flavor's banana. Trippy. Is it bad? Oh, mm. you got lipstick on it. I'm so sorry. I should have... Water I'll do waterfall. Ball. I'll do waterfall. Mmm. I thought I wouldn't like it, but it's actually pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty... Hmm, surprised. Okay, let's try the food. Which one should we try first? This looks like an appetizer. Okay, fine. Let's get with this. Okay, let's try it. Looks like there's some type of... It kind of looks like chickpeas, but... Yeah. Not sure. We're just gonna go in with no knowledge, like always. Mm-hmm. Mmm. I already like this bread. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm. That's bomb. Wow. Mmm, it's really good. You can really taste the curry inside too. Mmm. It kind of... Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it is chickpeas. Am I wrong? I'm gonna Google this. Feel free to educate us because that's the whole point of our yeah. videos. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, it is chickpea. I love chickpeas. Mm. So this bread is called baras. Mm -hmm. It's just so... I really like it. As it's soon good. as I took that first bite, the outside is so fluffy. It's chewy too though. Mm -hmm, but it's, it's savory. Like, mm -hmm. It tastes oily and savory. Mm -hmm. oh, very... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I taste something slightly sour in here. It's just mm -hmm. me. It's good though. Mm. Dang, I might as well just kill this. <laughs> Bomb. Mm. Mm. It's like they have something pickled in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's these. Mm. Yeah. Right, when it feels too like mushy, that little pickled things come in and it just stays in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Perfect. It's not too crunchy either. It's like kind of soft crunchy. Mm. It's bomb. 
No, oh, I'm gonna crave that. We should have got more. But actually, it's not awful. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put one on your side, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm. Um, bokja, bokja. Honestly, we drove pretty far to get this. We did, but oh my gosh, this is probably so the farthest we drove from all of our mukbangs. Is it? Yeah, yeah, it probably is. But I'm really excited to try this. Ooh, oh my goodness, guys, it smells amazing. It smells flavorful. It smells so Wait. good. Chicken. Mm hmm Chicken this sauce. It's bomb. It's kind of just curry. It kind of tastes like curry, right? Curry, but I don't know, a different kind of curry. I never tried this kind of curry, but it's bomb. Mm -hmm. There's carrots in here too. Mm -hmm. Oh, and they're soft. Mm -hmm. Everything oh just gosh. tastes really good. Oh. Oh my gosh. I know, right? Oh my gosh, that's really good. <laughs> this is good too. This wrap. Mm hmm. It's bomb. It feels like almost kind of a little grainy on the outside. Mm hmm. I love those kind of tortillas. Yeah. Is this a tortilla? I don't think this is a tortilla. What is this called? Is this called roti? Because Bangladeshi food, these were called roti. Like, this kind of... Not oh, true. But we may be wrong, so... I don't know. Let us know. Mm -hmm. It's like curry. But it's so meaty because of the chickpeas. Mm -hmm. It's a really hearty dish, mm -hmm. I feel like. Yeah, bomb. Before I get like... I know. Mm -hmm. Let's get some of this. Um... Mm. Ooh, this looks like there's peas in here too. Mm -hmm. Oh, the gravy's like all over the rice. Oh no, it's <gasps> sauced and so flavorful looking. Mm. And we got the oxtail here. Mm. That's so good. <laughs> it's almost like barbecue, right? The gravy's thick. Mm -hmm. Like the flavor is very rich too. Mm -hmm. It's smoky, mm -hmm. rich, and oh my god, mm. that's bomb! Oh my gosh, oh, we got some Pasta. pendant here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. The flavor is very rich. It kind of reminds me of kanjang. Right? Yeah. Mm, like soy sauce. Mm. Oh, it's not rich yet. I don't know. I really want to get there. <laughs> Look at this one. Look how hard that is. How am I supposed to get to it? <laughs> this is some like matrix right here. How am I supposed to get to the middle? <laughs> oh, I got it. I got mine too. So satisfying. Da -da, da -da 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 -da, it's a pan then. How do you get that? I skipped it off of my nail. Mm. These peas are so soft that I don't even notice myself chewing it. Yeah, they're not like um, Korean beans. Mm -hmm. The Korean beans, they don't really want to eat it. Cool. Yeah. Mm. Which one do you like the best from all three? I like doubles the best and I like the oxtail. This is good too, but if I have to choose, doubles and oxtail. Mm. On like mm -hmm. separate occasions. I like the doubles and chicken roti. You really like the oxtail? I like the oxtail, but if I have to choose like my top contenders, mm. I like all of it. Mm. Yeah, but you would like more of these type of foods, like something more um convenient yeah. to eat. Yeah, I like convenient. I like food. meals. Yeah, because whenever I used to work or I went to school, I used to always pack food and like secretly eat it. Yeah, I still pack meals. <laughs> mm. Mm. 
Mm. The sauce for the um oxtail is really good. Right? Yeah. Oh, oh! Oh! Just wanted to put it on top of my roti. Like seriously. I'll eat it. Wait, the kimono is really from Trinidad. I think she's Trinidad Trinidadian and Chinese or something. Chinese too? Yeah, I know she's part Asian. What? Yeah. Mmm. Good size there. It's good, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because there's so much flavor on the oxtail. And it adds like an extra meaty factor mm -hmm. to the chicken roti. I'm like this close to calling it a burrito every time. I know. That was so good. Oh my gosh. Oh wow, you finished that. Mmm. Such a nice one. Mmm. I love anything that has kare. Mmm. You know what I realized? Um, they probably don't sell kare bap at restaurants, right? It's like... Even right? Korean kare bap? Mm hmm that's true. We can never go to a store to buy karebap. Right? Like, not around us, at least. We should do karebap um, mukbang. Because Korean curry is pretty good. Yeah, that's true. We'll show you guys how Koreans eat Korean. Yeah. We'll make it. We should do a mukbang. Yeah, we'll do Korean 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 mukbang. Yeah. Korean curry. Let us know if you'll watch it. Mm-hmm. Guys, <sighs> right, so we mentioned in our last mukbang that when we hit 100k subscribers, we're going to do a Q&A video. So if you guys haven't already, make sure and go check our community section. We have a poster, so you can ask us anything and we'll answer your question on our Q&A video. So I've been really into watching Ariana Grande documentaries. Mm. Mm. So allegedly while she was working at Nickelodeon for, um, what was that show? Victorious? The producer or the network, whoever it is, or Dan Schneider is it? Basically, he's like obsessed with feet or something. Yeah. And then there's like weird scenes of Ariana Grande doing feet stuff. No, really? Yeah, you didn't watch it. I'll send you the link. From Victorious? Mm hmm. It was when she play, like, played Cat, right? Mm hmm. And they made her character like extra. Like in the first season, she doesn't sound kind of like airhead dumb. Mm hmm. But then as the seasons go, she sounds more kiddish and more airhead. Oh, they do that on purpose. Like, yeah. Make her look. Mm. Like she's a kid. I don't know, it's weird. It's weird. You guys should watch it. But wasn't she a kid at the time? I mean, they make her seem a lot younger than she was. Oh, I see. She's more than capable of speaking, like... And she was like, ah, hi guys! Yeah. Ah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But like, extra, extra. And I read online that she doesn't really like talking about her character. Oh, she has like trauma from it or something? I think so. I couldn't really pay attention to that because growing up, our parents didn't give us cable. We watched PBS. Yeah. <laughs> Channel 28. All day. I ran home after school at 3pm to watch Maya and Miguel. Oh my god, that was so fun. <laughs> I have that one show. Um, When you're walking down the street. That's Arthur. And you're like, I thought you would like Arthur. I did like Arthur, but I liked Clifford. Oh, the big red dog. Mm -hmm. And I really liked that one show. You know that science show that comes out at 3pm? This was like when we were in like middle school. Bill Nye, the science no, guy. No, not Bill Nye. I never watched Bill Nye growing up. Well, I'm so full. <clears throat> When I tell you guys this meal was amazing, like it was our first time so and well. it blew our expectations. It's really savory and that's what I love about it. If you guys want to know where we got this food, we're gonna leave it down below. So make sure to go and check them out. Mm -hmm. Give them some love. Their food is so good. Okay guys, we're super full. So I think we're just gonna end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give us a big thumbs up. Hit that like button, subscribe, post notification bell. Ding! If you guys haven't already, make sure to go ahead and follow our TikTok account and our joint Instagram account, and we will see you guys next episode. We'll see you guys then. Bye. -bye.